One of the best segments that we have here on Fox 17 Weather yeah. Kids is back. Now, you think back to your time in school, a lot of us might remember doing some sort of experiment where you, you kind of used baking soda to create a volcano vinegar. of some baking sort, yeah, something like that. This one's a little different, a, a, a salt volcano. Fascinating. Meteorologist Haley Vaughn shows us how in today's Weather Kid experiment. Hi, I'm meteorologist Haley Vaughn with Fox 17 News, here with Mrs. Tiller's first grade class at Goebbels and Elementary. And with this science experiment for today's weather kid, we are doing a salt volcano. So all we need is to have our jars filled with water, salt, food coloring, and some vegetable oil. That's it. And we're gonna create this salt volcano. So what I'm gonna have you guys do first, you all chose a color. I'm gonna have you squirt it in and do as many drops as you'd like, but ideally somewhere between three to about four drops. That's perfect. So next what we're gonna do is we're going to pour in the oil. You can see it, it's really still going. Okay, so I'm gonna hand you guys this olive oil, and what I want you to do is I want you to fill it up to about here, so just a little bit above. <clears throat> and I'll tell you when. That's perfect. All right, and we'll do a little bit more in this jar. Good. Make it. Perfect. So we have our water, our oil, and our food coloring. Now what I want you guys to notice really quickly before we do anything else, do you see how the oil is not mixing with the water? I'm gonna pour just a little bit more in yours. What we want is we want a good amount of oil in between the water, and you already have quite a bit, so I'm just gonna add a little bit yours too. Perfect, okay. So now you can see that thick line between the oil, the water, and your food coloring. You can see how it does not mix. It's because it has different densities, so it doesn't want to mix together. Now we're gonna pour our salt. There we go, perfect. All right, let's try this out. There we go. So what's happening is the salt, it's mixing with the oil. And you see how it's creating that? Going up and down. Perfect, yeah, and when you mix it, it kind of helps it create those bubbles. And it's all because of the density of the water, the salt, and the oil. Kind of fun, huh? All right, so that is today's weather experiment. We have our water, our oil, our salt, and our food coloring, and mixing it just right together, the right amount of salt, the right amount of oil, and you get a little tiny volcano, or what we like to call a lava lamp. So all of this and more can be found on our website, fox17online.com. That's that's pretty cool. The reaction of all the kids when they see it actually happen, that's got to be really fun. And then the secondary reaction to then go basically dump yeah, the rest yeah, of the salt. Yeah, the other kid was adding more table. salt. Like, more see what salt. more can happen. There's got to be some pressure when you go to do those things to make sure oh, there absolutely is. But that's right. the beauty of science is it's not always perfect, but mm -hmm. Haley executes those very well. Hey, the hey, kids hey have your a great forecasts time. are always perfect. <laughs> that's true, too. We'll take